Hey, YouTube, what's up? I was, uh... doing videos, so... my last one was like... 18 minutes long. Anyway... I wanted to show my pipe peeps. My, uh... my new Moretti pipe. And another pipe. And some tampers. I've been toying around with a few new tamper type stuff. I still haven't put the case on this one. I don't know if you can see. Um, it's just got carnauba wax on it. Can't really see. I said I was going to do it outside, but that is where the worms got into the pine. And I stained it carnauba wax course and uh, I'm gonna put the casing on this end this one I really like that is like smooth as glass this part let me see if I can get you a little bit better Actually, it's really nice. Um, same type deal. Digging through a pile full of um, old dead pine trees and then uh, staining them, sand them, stain them, sand them, a couple different grits, carnauba wax, and then buff them. So I got a couple of those. Um, they're kind of cool. They're, you know, nice. I actually posted one on eBay. I didn't, I wanted to see how easy it was or, you know, if I was even able to figure it out. And I was, and, and then I took it off because I just wanted to see before I did that. I wanted to see, so... I'm going to make a few of them. I want to see if they sell. Um, and I'm going to do them really reasonable. I just don't want to eat up the shipping charge. So I'm going to have to knock the price off of the tamper. And then put no free shipping. Knock the price off. Or, you know what I'm saying. Charge less to where it ends up being the same with them paying the $2 shipping or add the price in and do free shipping and you know sell them for five bucks or seven dollars including shipping I, I don't know some of them take a little bit of time to do um, and then when you know a lot of people know when you buy something they expect a whole lot more um, I mean a lot of people can look at some of the tampers and being nice they'll go man that's great those are nice you should sell them blah 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 but once they pull a dollar out of their pocket, they're going to find things wrong with it, and they're not going to be happy, or they're going to say, well, they're, you know, not all that great. And so, you know, it's fine giving them away. Everybody's happy with it. But when you start selling it, you have to put a lot of time into it um, and really have an eye for detail and, and just make it perfect. Uh, which takes time, which bumps up the price. So, you know, I really don't want to sell any of them. I just want to continue to give them away for free and, you know. But there is some that I've spent uh, a little time on. Uh, I mean, you got to let the stain dry for a day. And then you get sand and then you got to wax and, you know, sometimes stain twice. And Anyway enough about that got a couple little tampers going they're kinda fun to do 
in my last video I had mentioned a pipe I got from the flea market for five bucks. I cleaned this pipe up. Got the grain. see the bird's eye a little bit. Let's see what we can do here. Mm -hmm. Whoops. There we go. All that side's bird's eye. Very nice. Bird's eye, bird's eye, bird's eye. Five bucks. Can't beat that. All right. Now my Moretti. I'm gonna leave my pipe, my camera right here just because it, the lighting works out okay. Nice case. I looked at it. But I didn't even put it together. So, mm, 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 mm. I know, I know. Here's the pipe. Here's the stem. Okay. Moretti pipe. Stem. Sitter, which I liked about it. There's some character flaws, as you would say, right there. And there's one somewhere else on there, right there, in the briar. And it is a sitter. So I like it. I like it. It's it's a nice pipe. Very nice pipe. Um sorry. Very nice pipe. very light very nice this one um, as you can see which I think bones is I think his is a bigger pipe and his has got a lot nicer webbing I should say grain webbing um, they do Costs 18 bucks to ship. This one I won the bid um, 156.49. Uh, there was 16 bids for it. Um, this one uh, 156, and then 18 to ship. Um, and then of course 
the measurements length is 16 6 inches height of the bowl is 2.4 diameter of the chamber 7 8 the depth is 1.9 the weights 2.5 acrylic stem brown sandblast finish um, pipe cleaner does pass freely through it um, and this is off the, the summary of Moretti if you don't know or read it before uh, the briars age 10 years or more um, and then it goes on with the Moretti history and I won't get into that. It got the history and today. Uh, today the Moretti pipes are famous all over the world. Each pipe is meticulously fashioned by using hand calibration. Calibri Calibri Calibrian Briar seasons for 10 to 15 years or Bog Oak Morta season 4 to 6,000 years. Unlike most of the something made today, a Moretti pipe is completely hand done by a true artesian with no elaborate machinery. For example, Marco holds the piece of briar in his hand while boring the tobacco chamber. And the same with the shank bore. The process is rewarding but very demanding. An important feature which distinguishes Moretti pipes is the familiarity or most of with the smooth natural finish. 5% of the output is rusticated which meet anyway I'm not going to get into reading all this. You can just look up Moretti pipes and then look up the history of it it's I just thought it was interesting so if it sounds like something you might be interested in look up Moretti pipes and uh, it'll tell you about the history of when it was 1850s to the current today very happy with the pipe thank you bones for kind of sticking your foot in my butt to uh, show the pipe because I wasn't going to show it um, don't know why uh, there's several that I haven't shown, and I don't know why I don't. Um, I think a part of me is just because it feels like I'm flaunting. There is people out there that aren't smoking or don't have nice pipes, and I don't want to flaunt and say, look at what I got. It's a personal hang up of mine. Um, so when I hear that someone's interested in seeing it, uh, gives me a reason to show it. Um, I'm sure there is people that are less fortunate than, than uh, I am. Um, and believe me, you all you see me smoking is Medicos, Dr. Grabo's, um, basket pipes, uh, no name Italy $5 flea market pipes, that's what I smoke. That's what I don't have to worry about. Drop it, break it, leave it, lose it. Someone takes it, who cares? A couple dollar pipe. Um, but I do have some gold band, silver band, uh, Medicos and K Woodies and some older unsmoked, a lot of ones have been gifted to me. Um, and I, uh, I'm not going to name names, you know who you are. Um, and I thank you very much. Um, and eventually, you're going to get, you know, something back your way again, you know, just because uh, I cherish it and I appreciate it. And it was a very nice gesture on your guys' part. Um, like I said, I've seen guys gifted pipes and, you know, uh, I've been gifted a few. Cisco's been gifted a few and there's no words to express 
when you're gifted a pipe from somebody in the YouTube community. There's several that I've gotten and it just blows me away. Um, but anyway, thanks everybody for uh, watching. Uh, and I will try to make another video sometime soon. This one you're watching right now, I did this morning. And I had to wait until I got to work to upload it. Because it's much faster than waiting five hours, four hours on my internet at home. So, with that being said... Take care. I will definitely see you on the next video. Bye now.